Mooncat's bringing back some polishes. I brought back a set. Stay tuned after our regularly scheduled programming for a cat tax. What's up everyone, it's Kyle from Color Expression, back with another swatch and review. I'm excited to be partnering up with Mooncat today to look at six new or old, redone, upgraded, six upgraded shades from Mooncat. This is their Return of the Faves set. So it's actually four magnetic polishes and two metallic flaky, multi-chrome flaky polishes that were previously shades as Live Love Polish, which is what Mooncat was before they had their rebrand about a year ago. So they looked back in their catalog and they're bringing back six shades and I am very excited to look at these ones with you guys. These are all available today, so I will link the Mooncat website down below where you can pick these up. You can grab the whole set as a bundle for $79 USD or the individual shades range for $13 to $15 USD. <laughs> Quick correction, the set actually retails for $83 USD and the individual polishes retail for $14 to $16 USD. And I'll specify like which ones are which as we swatch each shade. If you don't know much about Mooncat, they are an independent nail polish brand that is based out of the USA. They are vegan and cruelty free and their formula is 10 free. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to like and subscribe with the notification bell turned on. That way you're never missing out on the new Mooncat or nail polish content. We of course have a lot of swatches and mixing and just fun stuff coming up that I don't think you're going to want to miss out on. It's so weird to be standing. I mean, now I usually sit. <laughs> All right, I feel like I'm like time traveling back in time to a year ago and I don't know how I feel about it. Let's just get onto the swatches. <laughs> first up, we will take a look at the two multi-chrome flaky polishes. So this first one is Dragon Scales. You can see we're getting a bunch of that multi-chrome metallic pigment and then a scattered hollow sort of large glitters and some smaller ones. So I really love the hollow effect in here. But as for this pink pigment, these are very cool. This is something, like I mentioned earlier, I had never seen a shade like this before. So these are not translucent, they're not transparent, they're just metallic flakes that are color changing. So head on in this bright light, you've been seeing them pink, but once we get to the next shot with the full hand, you'll see that shift over through to a little bit of yellow here, but then once we get to the next one, you'll see like some green and it's just such a fun range of color. I think it's, they're so shifty in person. It's such a fun look to have. And if you like standard multi-chrome polishes, I think these are a very fun twist on that effect. So I really love love now having this one in my collection. For the other multi-chrome flaky, we have Super Villain. So how the last one was pink to sort of green, this one is blue to purple. So we're getting a bunch of that pigment. This one I did feel could maybe be a three coater. I feel like some of the shards in here were finer than the other one. So it did build up really well still in two coats, but there was maybe like just a touch of patchiness after that second coat. So if you want that full, full coverage, you could do three coats or you could alternatively sponge this polish on so you paint it on to a like a makeup sponge and then you ch 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 dab that all over your nail but as you can see that's definitely not necessary for this polish it built up really well we're getting a lot of those hollow flecks we're getting so much of that blue pigment so I really loved the finished effect of this one and it is very shifty in real life you're getting so much of that purple I just I love the shift in this one. Purple is my favorite, just my favorite color on nails. So I think that the shift in here is so great. You can see there's even like some orange and gold and like, it's just so cool and shifty. This one is very kind of, um, it makes me think of like a reptile. Moving on to the four magnetics, the first one we will look at is Velvet Rose. So this one is a pink base color. And then in there, we're getting this magnetic pigment that right now it looks like a silver color, like head on. But once we sort of shift this one over and get that extreme angle on there, this one does go a little bit sort of like rose gold, like a bit of a golden, like slight yellow hue. So I like that we're getting a little bit of that color shift. And then also in here, we're getting a small scattered hollow pigment. So you'll sort of see that as you wiggle the nail around, you'll get like these glints of rainbow. So I think that the addition of that really heightens this polish. It would have been nice 
without the hollow, but the hollow is such a great addition. And like I said, once we sort of lean back and get that more extreme angle, you're getting that bit of a rosy gold hue on that magnetic line. So I thought that that was really just also a nice subtle addition, but it emphasizes the shade so much. Next we have Smokescreen, which I'm excited because I actually have the quote-unquote old version of this polish, so we are going to compare the two, but this one is a bit of a muted sort of mossy grayish green base, and there's so much pigment in this one you can barely even see that base color right now as we're applying it but that pigment is a pink magnetic pigment that does shift over to gold and orange and green and it kind of looks rainbowy you can see just emitting from around the center of that pink line we're getting this sort of rainbow effect and i think it's so cool and we're also getting a holographic glitter in here so just a really beautiful mix of ingredients in this one and and truly probably my favorite I mean like I said I owned this one technically before so I'm very happy with this upgraded version right away you can see they do look different this one has a bit of a more pigmented base here they are side by side you can see the magnetic pigment in the live love polish version was a little bit more gold to start with so we're getting a stronger and wider color shift in the upgraded one and here i was just kind of showing like the different size of the bottles i thought that that was interesting how much bigger the new bottles are so that was cool but as we look at the swatches here side by side you can see that super strong pink in the new shade that just head on in the exact same lighting did not it didn't look like that so the amazing range of color in the new one is just i like this is such a such an upgrade that's why i said that in the intro that's why i'm using that word again it's literally upgraded and then the old one was totally beautiful it had a bit of a pink in that bright light and then it still has that sort of rainbowy emitting out from the light and it did have hollow but they were a bit smaller and almost gave like a bit of a linear effect in person so the new one has a bit of a bigger hollow glitter and just all around i i think that they did a really good job Next of the return of the faves, we have Malevolent. So this one is a sort of black jelly base. You can't really see that here because we have so much of this magnetic pigment showing up, which head on, you can see it is a purple with some sort of pinky flecks in there. And then we're also getting a large golden holographic glitter as well as a smaller holographic glitter but the magnetic pigment in here shifts over to a like a gold in the extreme angle so once we start to see that in the full hand shot you'll really get that color changing effect and the way that the magnetic pigment all just pulls to that one line and then lets that really dark base with all the hollow shine through these are like instant galaxy nails you're getting the color change you're getting just a really cool effect and if you want like spacey outer space even like doing space stamping over this or something would just be so great i think that this polish is absolutely beautiful Rounding out this release, we have Apparition, which is, again, a sort of black jelly base here, but then we're getting a silver magnetic pigment that also has some little blue flex in it. I feel like the blue shows up a lot more in person, but it's sort of just this like very subtle hint of a cool blue in there. So I really liked that. And if you've been keeping along with the pricing, this is the only shade that is $14 of this set. So I believe that's because this is a different pigment. It doesn't have that sort of multi-chrome effect, but it's still so beautiful. I love the just dark nail and magnetic polishes are just so beautiful in their own right that having a black magnetic is so perfect i think this one also if you want a more subtle background for some like space nail art or stamping or something this is going to be a great option or if you just like black nails in general but you want to try a magnetic polish this is also going to be perfect for you 
now that we have looked at all of these new shades i want to hear your thoughts on them so leave a comment down below let me know which one is your favorite do you think you're going to pick any of these up or do you own any of the original shades that these were as live love polish i feel like the fact that mooncat as a brand can like look back in a previous catalog and see what people liked what people want now and be able to pick and choose and bring things back but even better is a very cool concept and i'm excited to see if and when they do that in the future what the next shades will be but for now I'm gonna enjoy I'm gonna enjoy these flakies and magnetics because they are very cool <laughs> Like I mentioned earlier, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, but I think that's going to be it for this one today. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye. I think I hear the cat and it has been a minute and it's a moon cat video. So hold on. Spin your body. <gasps> yeah. Not like that. Like a little, well, not like that either. Say hi. That's sweet. I'll put you down now. Okay.